What's up? Hey guys, it's Yvonne. In this quick video, I want to show you how you can see multiple different conversions under the same campaign in Google Ads. This is a question that I've been emailed a few times of people asking me, hey Yvonne, if I want to track opt-ins and conversions and sales and, 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 and whatever else for one campaign, how can I do that if there's only one conversion column? Unlike Facebook, where you have this specific view page column, right, for conversions, you have a purchase column, stuff like that. And the answer is pretty simple. Um, here I am in my live Google Ads account. So the first thing you have to do is obviously set up the conversions. Uh, check out my previous videos if you don't know how to do that. And then all you're going to do is click on segment, click on conversions. And if you want to segment them by conversion, the name of your conversion, you would select action. If you want to segment them by category, like lead, purchase, opt-in, you would select this. But basically what I'm gonna um, do is, is the basic here and go by name. So I'm click on conversion action and boom. As you can see here now, let's suppose I'm tracking opt-ins and sales under one campaign, under one funnel. Now I'll be able to see exactly how many you know, uh, opt-ins I got and how many sales, for instance. Now disregard, you know, the just one sale here. Um, I don't actually track purchases for this campaign, but I did set it up just for you guys so I could show you what this looked like um, if you were to have multiple conversions. So if you have a conversion set up for an opt-in, a purchase, a product of purchase A, B, and then C, and then D, and whatever, you'll be able to track everything here. All you have to do is click segment and segment by uh, conversion name and or conversion action um, and you will be able to see. So that is all that I wanted to share with you guys today. If you have any other questions, let me know down below. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, you will probably like my other videos on Facebook and Microsoft ads and how to set everything up for you to succeed. Uh, otherwise, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.